Hi, this is David Flynn from Australian Business Traveller with a close-up look at Qantas' new in-flight iPad entertainment system. The system, dubbed Q-Streaming, is being trialled throughout February 2012 on a Qantas Boeing 767-300 flying domestic routes around Australia. Passengers travelling in the 767 during the Q-Streaming trial will find an iPad 2 tucked away in every seat pocket through both business and economy class. So let's check out the Q-Streaming app. To log on to the aircraft's Q-Streaming Wi-Fi network, enter your seat number onto the iPad. This connects the iPad to one of five wireless hotspots mounted in the aircraft's ceiling. Q-Streaming is based on the Board Connect platform developed by Lufthansa Systems. The main menu lets you browse a number of categories of TV shows, such as comedy, drama and documentaries. You choose the program you want to watch, there's a detailed description for each individual program, and then press to play. On-screen controls, which fade in over the video, include the ability to scrub forward and back throughout the program. We'll duck out of documentaries and duck into comedy. As you can see, it mimics what you'd find on a conventional in-seat video system. It all runs quite smoothly, even if every 254 passengers on the 767 are watching the same show at the same time, according to Qantas. The Q-Streaming iPads also have the same pre-recorded radio program and music CD library as you'll find on Qantas Airbus A380s and Boeing 747s. None of the in-flight videos or music is stored on the iPads. Everything is sent from a content server system located under the floor of the cockpit. This mini computer has a pair of identical 500 gigabyte solid state drives, each of which contains all the in-flight programming so that even if one drive fails, the Q-Streaming system will keep running. You'll notice that a dual socket headphone adapter has been glued to the iPad to disable the internal speaker. While you can plug in the headphones supplied by Qantas, we enjoyed far superior sound by using a standard pair of iPod earbuds. Each iPad includes a survey so travellers can rate the system and also suggest future improvements. Qantas says that movies are the most requested addition to Q-Streaming, along with in-flight internet. Qantas hasn't yet made a decision on if it will roll out Q-Streaming to other aircraft in the domestic fleet, although it's said to be interested in building Q-Streaming into its Boeing 787 Dreamliners when they arrive in 2015 and 2016.